meteorologist Tom Atkins. Great to be back with you. Lots of pretty pictures for you. Let's start out at the Bayfront Nerdlings heating and air conditioning camera. As you can see, somebody already out boat on the bay there and uh, just warm weather with high thin clouds. We go over to Warren and check out foliage on our quick fill cam, Allegheny River Grand Valley Steel Plant in the distance there as you look over Veterans Memorial Bridge and uh, into the mountains there. So let's swing on into a pretty cool picture. If I can get it to go here. Well, take a break and uh, we'll, we'll just let you look at Warren for a second because we seem to have a little technical problem going on here and I'm not exactly sure what it is, but stay tuned and we'll show you another picture and hope this thing works. All right, this is down in northeastern Crawford County, the cows and the fog, okay? So some uh, really great shots here today. You get fog in the morning, you get a lot of foliage, you get sunshine and warm weather in the afternoon. I think I'm gonna exchange my clicker here. See if that works. There we go. Daytime satellite. There's your sunshine. There's your clouds with the showers. And on radar, of course, nothing really near us. As we go upstream to the north and west, little shower activity by St. Louis. And as we go down into the deep south, yeah, some stuff way out here. But this is where the nasty weather is in Tornado Alley. You can see Oklahoma and Texas bearing the brunt of the severe weather tonight. But look how it just weakens the thunderstorm activity as it moves towards our area. Uh, getting up into the mid 80s, even at ERI today, still squeeze out a 79 tomorrow and then the front and then the fall back into fall. Uh, low to moderate today and tomorrow, molds and grasses. Ragweed should be low tomorrow. UV index also low to moderate. Air quality expected to be good this evening and tomorrow. So another great day to be out and about on the boat. Despite the clouds, waves two feet or less south to southwest breezes, 10 to 15. There's your 84. 64 is the low, so temperature is way above normal, but still five degrees away from the record high. Warm into tomorrow. The transition day is Friday. It will be a chilly, damp, and unsettled weekend, but enjoy another sunset tonight. That one from Mark. That's just beautiful. 72 Bill in North Harbor Creek, 78 Lore in Edinburgh, and Becky in French Creek. Down south, we got 76 Kathy in Sagertown, 79 Paul in Albion, Summer to the east, 79 Warren Fire Department, 71 in Chandler's Valley. So for tonight, partly cloudy, very mild, 63 to 67 along the lake shore, north of 90. Then south of 90 inland, Edinburgh, Cory, Titusville, 56 to 62, uh, staying dry as the moon comes up shortly after 10. A few clouds in the mountains of Chautauqua, Warren, Forest, and McKean, calm, 55 to 59. So the clouds come in tomorrow, but it's still a decent day as we get near 80. The rain comes down tomorrow night and still mild tomorrow night. Then the drop on Friday with periods of rain. It will be breezy over the weekend with the cooler highs in the 50s, Saturday, Sunday, Columbus Day. Then the rain goes away Tuesday and Wednesday. The temperatures rebound mid 50s to near 60. Check out the seven day and all our great camera views on the Your Erie To Go app. One more beautiful day to get out and enjoy it. Yeah, take, it, take the advantage tomorrow. Yeah, all right, Tom,